London, Surrey and West London are known for being among the most desirable places to live in the whole south of England. The mix of large open parks, trendy bars and a quick commute to central London makes the area popular with families to the retired to businessmen. Fabloft is the new revolutionary way to create advanced, environmentally friendly loft conversions from highly insulated loft panels. The Fabloft system is quicker to build, more accurate, more energy efficient, is less disruptive to the customer and more tailored to the customer's needs than any other loft conversion system. This short video is an introduction into our Fabloft system. As loft conversion specialists in the southwest London and southeast of England areas, we have converted many lofts using the standard methods. With the loft conversion market being more busy than ever, we spent 2010 developing this revolutionary system. An average loft conversion takes 7 to 10 weeks to complete, whereas a fab loft system can take as little as 8 working days to finish. With the build time reduced so drastically, customers live more comfortably as their normal routine is less disrupted. The Fabloft process starts with a free technical survey from which all designs can be based. The panels for the internal walls, external walls and roof are constructed using precision engineering and craftsmanship only possible in a factory environment as opposed to the traditional on-site build. The first stage is the timber studwork frame of the panels being constructed. The wooden joists create the load-bearing potential of the outer walls which will support the roofing panels when erected on site. Once the framework is complete, plywood sheeting is cut to size and nailed to the frame to create the outer skin of the wall or roof. The windows, doors and recesses are then cut out at the factory to make installation of the panels on site as quick and tidy as possible. The availability of plans and accurate heavy machinery also reduces error and inaccuracy. It also allows for the recycling of excess material. The panel is then flipped to expose the cavity divided by the stud work joists. This space is filled with insulation which is cut using a highly accurate bench saw, too big to use on site. The use of this ensures an accuracy to within a quarter of a millimeter, which in turn increases the energy efficiency and decreases your heating bills. I mean I spoke to a sustainability consultant and there is an accepted value of a 30% loss of uh, performance from what is tested and what is specified by Kingsburn and Celotex and all of those guys to actually what's installed on site. Where Fab Loss would make that difference is it sort of bridges that gap of 30% of loss and brings it you know, a lot tighter to the test conditions and thus the performance conditions. At the same time as fitting insulation, power points and the piping to contain the wiring is installed into the panel. This decreases the construction time on site as carpenters and electricians are not waiting for each other to finish before beginning the next stage. Another advantage is that the power points will be exactly where you want them, which avoids the typical problems of plug sockets being inaccessible behind sofas or units. Interior wall panels will have both sides plasterboarded and bathroom panels will be fitted with a water and moisture resistant marine plasterboard. This once again reduces on-site construction time by having the panels pre-prepared before plastering. Unlike on-site where there are space limitations and it is impractical to organise off-cuts, in the factory there is no waste. Sawdust is packaged and sold for use in man-made boards, off-cuts are used in gaps and excess timber is used to protect the panels during transport. Finally, the panels are labelled with their positioning on site and stacked ready for transport. It normally takes a day to make one panel on site using the factory equipment. A higher quality panel can be constructed in only two and a half hours. The advantages of a fab loft are there's less waste, there's less hassle for the customers, there's less mess and people at the customer's house, it's more accurate, and there's less exposure to the weather and all the timber we're using is dry and straight than what it would be if it was stored on your scaffold on, a, on any other job. The next stage is preparing the building for the new loft. The amount of work needed depends on what size loft conversion is required. For some designs, it may only involve removing a small section of roof for a dormer to be installed. For others, it may involve removing all of the roof. Using traditional on-site construction, panels are only then built when this preliminary work is completed. Unlike with a fab loft system, which allows this to run concurrently, greatly reducing the timescale of the build. For this build, the ceiling of the upper floor also needed reconstruction. Time was once again saved by creating the joists and beams at the factory in bulk and delivering them on site.
The panels are transported safely from our factory in Adelston to the location of the build. When the panels arrive on site, a crane will be ready to transfer the panels one by one from the lorry into their required positions on the roof. Using screws, bolts and temporary wooden supports, the panels will be locked in place. It takes just 15 minutes to lift, detach, align and screw in each wall panel. In just three hours, all walls are up and in place and work can begin in installing the roof. This starts with rolled steel joints being positioned on either end of the roof and bolted into place. Roofing panels are then lifted onto the roof in a similar manner to the wall panels. Communication with the customer is very important to us. It serves to ensure that the new space is tailored perfectly to your requirements and to inform you of what is happening and what will happen to help minimise disruption. Once the tile comes out, and the tile comes yeah. up here, set it back slightly. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, okay, that sounds good. Fine. Okay? Good. This build was a very large loft conversion project, as not many required the complete reconstruction of roofs and walls. Despite this, in just one day, all of the walls and roofing is in place, a task that would be impossible using any other method than the Fabloft system. You could go away you know, for a holiday and come back and get involved in the tiling of the bathroom. That's how quick it should be. In just a week after the panels are first put in place, electrical cabling, plumbing, first floor stud walls, end of roof gables and conservatory Velux windows are already installed. The marble team headhunt the best tradesmen and our apprentices have won the Apprentice of the Year award from the Federation of Master Builders.